classrooms. Of course, they are learning a ton, but do they know how to protect themselves in situations if it is hopefully never needed? But maybe that's the walk to or from school. We're watching out for you and your family with some easy tips that can save a life. News 5's Caroline Peters joining us live. Bree, good morning. That's definitely true. It's important for kids to know how to protect themselves, but it's also important for adults to know how to protect themselves as well. I know for myself, I was recently in a very scary situation, and if things had escalated, I realized right then and there that I didn't know what to do or how to protect myself. That's why we're here today with Isaac, and he's the owner here at CFMAF. He is going to teach us how to protect ourselves. Thanks for joining us, Isaac. You're welcome. You're welcome. Absolutely. Now, what I want you to do is go through a situation. His wife, Heather's back here and they're going to demonstrate a situation that could happen to anyone. Absolutely. This is going to be a scenario of someone that's just walking away. She's a little boxed in and we're going to show you just a little scenario on what you'll be able to do when you apply the basics the correct way. Come here. No. I said come here. Leave me alone. Stop. No. Come here. No. 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 Excellent job. So as the other people set up, you'll see as they set up here back again, guys, quickly for you guys here, you'll see that she's able to utilize first when she's being grabbed. So the person got close to her, so she goes ahead, go ahead and grab, please. And she hits them in the eyes, takes them under his chin, breaking his balance to make him fall. But now she has to get into striking. So we have another person that's coming towards her. She utilizes her kicks, and now a guy's punching. She's able to go ahead and utilize a different throw. Over here, we'll have these two guys go ahead and show. Stop. No. Stop. And let's show that same scenario again. It's happened before, but here's the intimidation factor. The guy's grabbing us here. What do we do? He's strong. We have to give him a diversion. Go ahead, guys. Stop. And then he goes and breaks his balance, and look what he does here. Easy throw. To go ahead and Thank take you, someone Isaac. out. Now, what they do here is they hope it doesn't come to this point, and they teach those kids the confidence they need in order to enact that self defense, correct? Uh, absolutely. The best fight ever fought is the fight that's never fought. Increase your awareness skills, maintain and gain distance to stop them from putting their hands on you. But when the what ifs come into play, we have the tools to make sure you're the victor instead of the victim. Thank you so much. And you guys, he has classes for all ages and for the entire family here. We'll have more information in the next half hour. For now, I'm going to send it back to you. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs. Caroline Peters.